We've been meeting here today to discuss uh, the left and the radical left's answer to militarism and war. And obviously, due to the current situation, the focus of the discussion was mostly about Ukraine, but not only. We've discussed the background of the current confrontation, we've discussed the geopolitical situation, but also the development of the European uh, Union as a militaristic power. And we've also discussed the context between and the connections between um, war on the one hand side and economic interests on the other side. And we try to find ways in which to overcome the current confrontation, to go beyond. And this is the task as a radical left we have today. My initial remark was uh, on a quote of uh, Rosa Luxemburg, who was saying that we in the left should not try to seek peace utopias, but discuss concretely what are the actual political problems and the solutions. I think that we have agreed, despite our disagreements, that NATO cannot be an agent for peace in Europe, neither the NATOization of the European politics a solution. I have tried to demonstrate the necessity for an immediate end of the war in Ukraine through diplomatic means by an agreement which would, of course, fully respect the sovereign and legitimate rights of the Ukrainian people and of the Ukraine, but also would make an end to this uh, uh, spending of human lives who cannot continue anymore.